Wimmer's backyard on 7th Ave. And you can see there's quite a bit to do here. We've got ivy that we need to kind of keep away from the shrubs so it doesn't start to climb and choke them. Um, and just some spring cleanup going on in this area. Um, some weeds. We have little foxgloves coming up. And this could be taken out back here. By the time we get here, most likely we'll be cutting back, you know, daffodils, tulips. But there's lots of little weeds, clover, spurge, remnants of spurge that need to be dug out. And, you know, we'll see a bunch of various volunteers throughout. But here's some more spurge that needs to be taken out. Um, after the iris bloom, we're going to take chunks of them out and transplant them to the front. We can go over that later. Um, but just to give you a scope, the shrubs need some trimming, so we'll need a ladder. <laughs> and um, you want the ivy out of this tree, right? Yeah. So it doesn't kill it. Yeah. So again, and the ivy needs to be contained yeah. and out of the shrubs. And then over here, we have the purple sage that needs to be cut back. Um, it's starting to push new growth, so we'll just trim it down to the new growth and, and cut it back a bit. Um, this area we're going to work on. We'll probably chip away at this area. Um, it needs new soil. Yeah, it needs new soil and it needs to definitely be cleaned out. And then come time for gardening, this we'll just get all this cleaned up, this spurge dug out. Um, you do want the garlic gone? Um, I think so. I don't know. Should we wait and see? Yeah. Maybe wait on the garlic and you can decide. But this whole area needs cleaned out. There's a lot of volunteers and um, stuff that needs to be trimmed and up and cleaned out. there's a bunch of, well, there's, you know, weeds, gra grasses and stuff. I, yeah. I, I may have, it depends on when you come, I may have worked on some. Oh, yeah. and these, these things, oh, they're those little yellow, um, tiger lilies? Yeah, they're little mm -hmm. and they're, 